Hey guys, True Blood Way back. I'm Aaron. I'm Calvin. I'm Jancy. Eric. And we are here with Barbie. Uh, in fact, we're going to be having the whole Barbenheimer thing going on because next week is also going to be Oppenheimer, <gasps> which is going to be great. And if you're watching this on YouTube, you can find it early access already over at blindwave.com. Do we have outfits for Oppenheimer? Uh, I do. I do. <laughs> <laughs> um, Barbie. Barbie, I have actually already seen this. It okay. was one of the things we did uh, Interesting. For, uh, for kids' birthday stuff and whatnot. So, gotcha. Um, but you guys don't believe any of you have seen it, right? I have not, but I, I kind of got the gist on TikTok. Like, I tried to skip them. Yeah, you just... <laughs> if I point, hand me tissues. <laughs> Can do. Uh, much like other Mattel properties, like Battleship, I'm... I'm I would, That's a good one. I, I would oh, yeah, think that, that this is a movie devoid yeah. of much themes and thought, and we're just here to sell some toys. But Margot from what, Robbie. From what I understand, that's not the case, and people really, uh, really gel with this movie. So I'm here to see what the commotion is about. This had people picking sides of stuff that yeah. are like, but it's a toy. But what are what the sides? mean? Why? So we'll, we'll have to discuss that one. Yeah. Yeah. Like to see, like, Wait until they come out with like the biopic of Mr. Potato Head. That, that stuff will really get you right here, oh, you know? Man. True story. Right? <laughs> I don't know. I know I'm making fun of it a little bit, but I am ready to be impressed mm -hmm. because the standards are high because I've heard some really good things. Well, yeah. All right. Yep. Well, we are going to get into this. There is going to be a full-length version. You can find that over at blindwave.com. Just make sure you have your own reference footage. Uh, because it will just be our reaction. No, no footage of that. Um, otherwise, I can't say anything else. I don't want to spoil these people. So let's start. Pink. Yeah. This is my kind of movie. Yeah. Oh, Warner. <laughs> this is a movie they didn't turn it. Wait, for why is it rated for violence and sexual content? <laughs> I remember this trailer being pretty crazy, so I'm, I'm excited. You remember a lot of the trailer? Yeah, it had the monolith from 2001 A Space Odyssey. <laughs> I don't think I even watched the trailer. <laughs> the girls who played with them could only ever play at being mothers. Which can be fun. At least for a while, anyway. Look how much fun they're having. Ask your mother. Oh my she gosh. She's huge. <laughs> <laughs> that girl's so cute. Look at her. <laughs> her eyes are so wide. <laughs> I deny this, baby! <laughs> the, uh, the bits of tea set are <laughs> going flying. I hate you, baby. Oh they my break? gosh. I hate yeah. you, baby. I guess I expected them to be like plastic, but they dolls. were, yeah. Porcelain they used dolls, to be porcelain. Yeah. Wow. What an intro. And that was your trailer, right? Yeah. I felt the freedom. Yes, Barbie changed everything. Then she changed it all again. Because Barbie can be anything, women can be anything. And this has been reflected back onto the little girls of today in the real world. The real world, okay. Girls can grow into women who can achieve everything and anything they set their mind to. Thanks to Barbie, all problems of feminism and equal rights have been solved. <laughs> that would be nice. Okay. <laughs> That's, nice. That's what the Barbies think. Uh. Oh, they're living in Barbie land. Who am I to burst their bubble? I like how the road spells Barbie. Uh, yeah. One of those Barbies now. Living her best day ever. In the dream house. She slept with makeup? She never takes it off. <laughs> Maybe in Barbie Land there is no makeup, and you just don't have force. <laughs> what? I, I remember that from the trailer. Yeah. She walks like that. Yeah. Okay. What's she wearing? Man, and the Barbie's feet were always like that. Though. Yeah. They had to fit in the little high heels. I had an April O'Neil Barbie. A what? April O'Neil. Yep. From uh... Ninja Turtles. Whoa! Yeah. Is she Jesus? Oh no. No, it's fake. Like, okay, I get it. <laughs> this is literally She's the dream. Mar Margot Robbie wanted that slide. That was one of the stipulations yeah. of being in this movie. It's like, I need a slide that goes to the pool. That's, that's her, what she. Okay. That's what her toy had. I have one demand, and it's really weird. <laughs> it's not weird. It's Barbie. I think she had a second one too. I think she had two. I wanted a dream house when I was little. I remember that. I don't think I had one. Cow. <laughs> I love that really funny. Okay. Pink just looks so good on us. Hey, pretty. 
So Barbie Land is a geographical location apart from the real world? Yes. What's that? Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah, it's, not, it's not in the real world. Yeah. It's like Toontown. Kind of. Kind of, yeah. She flies <laughs> now? But the Barbie floats. thing. You take your Barbie and you put it down in your car, you know? No elevators. Yeah. And you have to angle her just like that We're so her feet can stairs go Stairs are a waste of space on a toy. They're hard to my make. Midge. <laughs> Barbie, both hands in the wheel! It's driving itself. Uh, it's not know. like she can hold it. Or someone else will drive. Hi, Barbie. Yay, space! <laughs> <laughs> Gosh. All right, now we know the status quo. This looks like Santa Monica. What layers do we... Ken! If Barbie looks at him. <laughs> Hi, Barbie. Hi, Barbie. Hi, Barbie. Hey! <laughs> oh, I didn't know he was in this. Did I? Uh -huh. Hi, Ken. Hi, Ken. I got us both ice cream. Cool. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Hi, Barbie. That was the second thing. She wanted mermaid Barbie. Okay. Hi, Barbie. Ah. Oh, your shirt. Ah. There are no multiples of Alan. He's just Alan. Why aren't you wearing any shorts? confused about that. Hey, Barbie, <laughs> check me out. So many kids, one out. She's watching, bro. Here's your chance. Hey, dude, that's the dude from Secret Invasion. Yeah, it is. Ken! And Mr. Manager. Do it, Ken! <laughs> oh. <laughs> if I wasn't severely injured, I would beat you off right now, Ken. I'll beat you off with you any day, Ken. Hold my ice cream, Ken. <laughs> All right, Ken, you're on. Let's beach off. Anyone who wants to beach him off has to beach me off first. I will beach. What's a beach off do? I do not know. You don't even know how to beach yourself off. I eyeliner on. <laughs> Michael is disturbing. Beach yourself off. You're gonna beach Come both on, of us off. Beach. Nobody's gonna beach anyone off. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> 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 It's so a full, full medical full suite. It's totally a toy. <laughs> like a toy, yeah. Yeah. I love how theatrical it is. It's like everyone's on a stage, you know? Mm -hmm. Not even broken. You'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Can I come to your house tonight? Sure. I don't have anything big planned. Just a giant blowout party with all the Barbies and plant choreography and a bespoke song. You should stop by. So cool. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay. Bye. Goodbye. All the Barbies. Interesting. <laughs> And the kid realizes song. he's an accessory, right? <laughs> but he doesn't want to be an accessory. <laughs> <laughs> Shoulder dances. I don't know why he feels so out of place. <laughs> <laughs> Good cut. Oh, dude. Look at him dance back there. He's so talented. <laughs> <laughs> Looking good, Barbie. Thanks, guys. <laughs> I'll take my challenge. Look at his face. <laughs> oh, hi, Ken. <laughs> hi. I am kind of reminded of the Barbie and Ken from what? Toy Story 2? Yeah. Is that what it is? Yeah, there was Barbie and Ken that. Mm hmm. This is the best day ever. It is the best day ever and so I feel like I'm gonna go crazy. <laughs> After tomorrow and even Wednesday, it's an every day. Why? It's, it's also just, superficial it's just, and shallow. It's, yeah, it's the same you circle that we're living in over and over. What'd she say? I don't know why I just said that. I'm just dying to dance. <laughs> All right, you almost broke reality. Yes. Or the illusion we tell ourselves is reality. She mentioned death. You don't do that with play. You're busy being like, it's all the same circle. They say the yeah. same thing all the time. And then they said something different. You're like, oh, wait, what happened? Yeah, I'm good. That's what I was expecting to have. <laughs> you can go now. I thought I might stay over tonight. Why? Because we're girlfriend, boyfriend. To do what? I'm actually not sure. <laughs> <laughs> and most everything they made for the sets too, Barbie's like 23% bigger than everything. That yeah. Just like in the toys. Mm-hmm. Goodbye, Barbies. I'm definitely not thinking about death anymore. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. I love this. She is. <laughs> yeah. Hair's not quite as perfect. No makeup. No makeup. <laughs> Woke up late. <laughs> she, uh... 
<laughs> okay. She hurts now. Hey, hey. Bobby. Hey. Hey. <laughs> so Could it be those irrepressible <laughs> thoughts of death? <laughs> no way. <laughs> Couldn't possibly be. Oh, that's cold. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's gonna be spoiled. Did you Ugh. see the box? <laughs> Expired. <laughs> Real big just says expired. Yeah. Why do you keep this? <laughs> <laughs> Why does it say expired on it? <gasps> Black <Bean! laughs> That scream That's was so, so good. <laughs> I heard that she used to be the most beautiful Barbie of all, but then someone played with her too hard in the real world. No, not no. dinosaurs! That looks like fun. I gotta say. <laughs> no, don't burn! Wait, so is this how she looks now? <laughs> yep. <laughs> the real life in the Barbie life. <laughs> okay. Hi, how are Oh, cool, okay. <laughs> the sound effects. Yeah. Flap. <laughs> yeah. I'd like to see what kind of nude blob he's packing under those jeans. <laughs> nude blob. <laughs> and then you're gonna start getting sad and wishy and complicated. No! <laughs> Her eyes. <laughs> <laughs> She's getting really excited about it. Go to the real world. And never the twain shall cross. The twain is crossing? Yes. And so the, the reality's not little. She must be sad and her thoughts and feelings and humanness are interfering with your dullness. If you do not find her and fix things, what's ugly will become uglier. And what's weird will become weirder. And then you look like me. Thank you. Like cellulite is the worst thing in the world. <laughs> they don't know anything worse. Closer I am to find. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> what are you doing here? I'm coming with you. No, please get out of here. I can't. I made a double bet with Ken, and you can't make me look uncool in front of Ken. Ken's not cool! He is to me. Oh, you're just gonna slow <laughs> me down. Right. What if there's beach? What if there's You'll beach? Need someone who's a professional in that. <laughs> Did you bring your roller blades? I literally oh go nowhere God. without them. Please. Those are wow. so they bright. They have to be custom made. Wow. Those are so bright. No one would ever try to that sell those so in real life. What if there's beach? <laughs> what if there's beach? There's beach in LA. <laughs> I love how toyish everything is. Yeah. And now they have outfits for everything. Yeah. Yeah, a different outfit for each place. Why are they in Holland? Hey, it's Aaron. <laughs> I remember a, a Barbie game that had like this thing. You had to like rollerblade like uh, through like Venice Beach. And oh stuff. yeah, here we are. My sister couldn't beat it, so I had to beat it for her. <laughs> and there's no undertone of violence. Mine very much has an undertone of violence. Oh look, a construction huh. site. We need that oh, no. good feminine energy. <laughs> Ladies. They're looking for the feminine. <laughs> you got fries with that, well, I said you had a hot body. Would you hold it against me? Is that a mirror in your pocket? Hey, baby, you are an angel. I can see myself in your shorts. I don't know exactly what you meant with all of those little quips, but I'm picking up on some sort of entendre, which appears to be double. I get the warnings and the readings now, Calvin. I do not yeah. have a vagina. I do not have a vagina. And he does not have a penis. <laughs> We don't have genitals. That's okay. Yeah, yeah whatever. Okay, no, okay. The Supreme Court. <laughs> the Supreme Court. <laughs> oh, I don't remember that. <laughs> I love me. Barb and Ken. Yeah. It wasn't just Ken. I think we should get some different clothes. Oh, no. Perfect. Great. Go for a walk or something. By myself? Yes. Really? Where? Anywhere! Can I go that way? Yes. Okay. <laughs> what? That's so creepy! <laughs> <laughs> They're just chanting mid. Yeah, look at that car. It's four wheel steering. Oh, oh horses. horses. <laughs> <laughs> Be your own man. Good thing Obi's not here. Yeah. 
Here, tackle the TV. So he's getting all the characteristics now of men in the room. Oh my oh, god, gosh. he can be his own person and not only related to Barbie, right? Well, yeah. Ken can be anything in the real world. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, Stallone! <laughs> men! 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 <laughs> <laughs> well, a little hard there, buddy. <laughs> oh, is she outgrowing her? You're so beautiful. I know it. Yeah. <laughs> Barbie! Barbie! <laughs> yes! I, I got, got it. it! Oh, what do you got? You go first. No, 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 you go. We'll go with the same Okay. Men She's rule the world! Men rule the world! But what did you say? Mattel headquarters. Okay. Ugh. I heard about 10 years ago, a woman named Skipper turned up at some family's home in Key West, asked to babysit the kids. She then tried to take their toddler surfing. Jeez, I know. They were able to straighten it out, keep it under wraps, but this is serious. She had a Skipper. Yeah. That was like Barbie's friend, wasn't it? It was like her little sister. Or something. Little sister yeah, or West? something, yeah. I think there are two girls, a little younger than her. What floor are you going to? All the way up. <laughs> but what do we really see? Oh, man. I'll tell you what. Some dreams and a magic will <laughs> Their table's also a heart. Yep. Yeah. And the light, too, above it. No. 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 The chair. They're okay. All right. I'm just gonna pop into the library and see if I can find any books on trucks. Okay, just don't get in trouble. I won't. He's also bratty. <laughs> I mean, it's just, it's just masculinity, I think. Yeah. At all, and then he can't wander. Well, around. it's the way he's walking yeah. that kind of tells me something. Huh. Aaron, is Sasha... Hey. Ahsoka? Yeah. Okay. Her face... Okay. All right. And until you showed up here and declared yourself Barbie, I hadn't thought about you in years, you fascist. Okay, that's happening again. <laughs> I have to. Will you excuse me? It was really nice talking to you. The girl warned her. Uh -huh. I guess so, yeah. You never listen. <laughs> There's a book Blind men that rule, says literally. that. Men in war. <laughs> so, toxic masculine. <laughs> you respect me. Sorry, no, do you know what time it is? No, I did not. <laughs> okay. Why didn't Barbie tell me about patriarchy? Which, to my understanding, is where men and horses run everything. <laughs> men and horses. I shall seek my fortune there. All right. Do you think it's a place? Okay, high level, high paying job with influence, please. Okay, you'll need at least an MBA. And a lot of our people have PhDs. Isn't being a man enough? Actually, right now, it's kind of the opposite. You guys are clearly not doing patriarchy very well. No, <laughs> no, we're, uh, we're doing it well. Yeah, we just, uh, hide it better. <laughs> oh my god. She thinks I'm a fascist? I don't control the railways or the flow of power. <laughs> She thinks she's Barbie. Wait, what did you say? She thinks she's Barbie. She's like fully convinced. She didn't save the Barbie out for her. She saved it for herself. Wow! The mothership! I kind of use that one th song. It's like her theme song, too, of like Mattel and Barbie stuff. Hi! Would you like some mineral water? Yes, thank you. <laughs> I'm not used to that having any. <laughs> 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 
Thank you. Why is he kneeling? <laughs> he doesn't have a chair. <laughs> yes, can. Get the guy. Yeah. <laughs> No, stop him! He's gonna ruin everything! Gonna ruin you. <laughs> oh no. There's the twist ties. Oh my like gosh, they're huge! Yeah, I know, right? Oh, huh, huh, you know what? Um, I guess she really had to go to the bathroom. Get that for me! <laughs> All these men in the suits are chasing her now. That button, let me push it. Only exactly. Let me push it. Don't you dare push that button. <laughs> It's quicker. Sure. It's quicker. <laughs> it's like taken. <laughs> oh my god. That was great. He's telling her which way to run. It is like the Matrix now. Back. What was the, the guy with the keys? That, that one place? Yeah. What is this place? <laughs> I always um. find, I think, best at kitchen tables. <laughs> She's the uh, Trando from Bad Batch. Uh huh. Rhea Perlman? Mm hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Um. Ruth. Ruth. Thank you, Ruth. You're welcome, Barbie. Oh. <laughs> oh. Key card! Wait, no, no. I don't have my key card! Key card. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. We're never gonna get Barbie! Oh, we didn't need it! We didn't need it! I've been a little lonely lately. And I found those Barbies we used to play with. Well, we gave those away, so I started playing with them. Yeah, she's she drew the picture of the Barbie with the thoughts of death. Yeah. <laughs> Watch the road. I love this gas. <laughs> those were your memories. Look real. Or Lee <laughs> <laughs> sense of accomplishment. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> like what? Nothing any of our collective imaginations could ever dream of. A podcast hosted by two wise trees or a choir of 2,000 young fathers. Not even close. He's trying with his imagination. <laughs> Just pick a direction and run! <laughs> Just pick a direction and run! <laughs> that's strange. Yep. Cause that's the man Now it's like Top Gun. <laughs> yeah. It's totally Top Gun. Twersky beer! Hi, Bob! Uh, John Cena. Okay, hi, Ken! Ooh. Have a brewski beer. Ah! Ken. <laughs> It's like spray painted over Barbies. Mm -hmm. Horses. No. These are the dream houses. The firefighter helmets. What do the Kens say? I don't know. At first I thought the real world was run by- Did he take her house? Yeah. Where I thought it was run by horses. But then I realized that horses are just men extenders. Oh, I had that tree house. I saved up my allowance to buy it. I've never seen a car like that before. No. He ruined it. Yeah. Basically everything exists. He looks ridiculous. <laughs> presence of men. This is my dream house. It is my dream house. It's mine. No, this is no longer Barbie's dream house. This shall henceforth be known as Ken's Mojo Dojo Casa House. You don't have to say dojo and house and casa. But you do because it feels good. Try it. Mojo dojo. No girls. These mojo dojo casa houses are literally flying. So when they do it in Barbie Land, it yeah. becomes a real uh -huh. thing in the toy line. 
No, I got into this business because of little girls and their dreams in the least creepy way possible. Now, Blade Faster, time is running out. Look. They look so uncomfortable. We're all voting they in, do, they? in suits. I can't believe how great this place is. No, no, no. They don't have it figured out in Century City because we failed them. No, you failed me. Out there, I was somebody. And when I walked down the street, people respected me just for who I am. One lady, she even asked me for the time. No way. Way. Oh, yeah, watches. <laughs> Here I'm just a dude. And you know what? That's not why they got me. TV remote. Sorry. In just 48 hours, all the Kens will head to the polls and vote to change the Constitution to a government for the Kens, of the Kens, and by the Kens! You can't do this. This is Barbie land. The Barbies worked hard and they dreamed hard to make it everything that it is. You can't just undo it in a day. It is not fun, is it? It's boy night! Every night is boy's night. I know, that's why it's so good. <laughs> Get out! Oh my god, the despair. <laughs> this is the lowest I've ever been. Emotionally and physically. Okay, kids. It's time to run out and get the new depression. <laughs> oh god. It's all day and night. She spent seven hours today on Instagram looking at her estranged best friend's engagement photos while eating a family-sized bag of Starbursts. And now her jaw is killing her. And she's going to watch the BBC's Pride and Prejudice for the seventh time until she falls asleep. The of our families is such that any alliance between us must be <laughs> So good, though. Anxiety, panic attacks, and OCD sold separately. <laughs> Barbie, sold separately. Wake up. Hey. <laughs> Barbie! Oh. We interrupt this broadcast to bring you our new radio station, only playing Ken's favorite song. I will, well, I will. Sorry, I'm a press. Oh my god. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Alan. As soon as they figure out how to build that wall sideways and not just up, <laughs> no one is going to be able to get in or out. So if we want to leave, we better make a run for it. No, Alan, you can't go. Having a Barbie in the real world is what caused all these problems. They have no so experience. dumb. Huh? Yeah. So no. Stupid. In fact, it's happened before. Yeah. All his clothes fit me. <laughs> Action figure. Get in the car. Let's keep it singing. <laughs> no, wait, you don't have a driver's license. This car doesn't have an engine. <sighs> Fine. Kendo. No. What are you doing? You gotta go. You have to go back. You've always believed in what she could be. Yeah, well, I was wrong. Okay, Alan, back. Alan is kicking ass. I'm the one who ruined Barbie Land with my stupid drawings in the first they're place. They're not stupid. They're amazing. You like my drawings? They're weird and dark and crazy. Everything you pretend not to be. Sugar daddy? No, 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 no. I'm not a sugar daddy. Uh, oh. This is sugar, and I'm her daddy. And I have an error. A magic error. These are actual Kens. I'm not pretty anymore. What? You're so pretty. I'm not stereotypical Barbie pretty. Note to the filmmakers, Margot Robbie is the wrong person to cast if you want to make this <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Smart enough to be interesting. That's so You're good. so smart. I can't do brain surgery. I've never flown a plane. We have to always be extraordinary. But somehow we're always doing it wrong. 
Like you have to be thin, but not too thin. And you can never say you want to be thin. You have to say you want to be healthy, but also you have to be thin. You have to have money, but you can't ask for money because that's crass. But never forget that the system is rigged. So find a way to acknowledge that, but also always be grateful. You have to never get old, never be rude, never show off, never be selfish, never fall down, never fail, never show fear, never get out of line. It's too hard, it's too contradictory, and nobody gives you a medal or says thank you. And it turns out, in fact, that not only are you doing everything wrong, but also everything is your fault. And if all of that is also true for a doll, just representing a woman, then I don't even know. I like that scene. Wait. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I did write a book. It's like I've been in a dream where I was somehow really invested in the Zack Snyder cut of Justice. <laughs> 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 Hell yes, white savior boy. <laughs> white savior boy. <laughs> you have to make them believe that you're complacent, that they have- I thought using the same song from the intro. Yep. You take the power back. Helen, go around. <laughs> <laughs> He's still, He's still struggling. Stuck. I am so awkward and don't feel pretty at all. And will anyone ever like me? Or distract them with the old standby, wearing glasses so that they can discover that you're pretty. Yeah. Sure, go ahead. May I? <laughs> oh my gosh. It wasn't anything about it. She's all that with yeah. 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 It's like, wait a minute. She was pretty anyway. There you are. <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing? He's cleaning. <laughs> He's straightening up. <laughs> this has a video of a horse back there. Mm -hmm. Hey, Obi would love it. Yeah. Reading. Oh. Caught me reading. Yeah, right. I'm ready to be your long-term distance, low-commitment, casual girlfriend, if you'll still have me. You just hold on for one second. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Please. Okay. Come on in. I'll play the guitar at you. At you. <laughs> I'll play the guitar at you. Man, he's so good in this role. He's playing Bush again. <laughs> oh, man. I do love this song. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh god. It's on loop. <laughs> That fake fire. Yeah, yeah I know, right? <laughs> so good. A little bit angry, well. We just might feel good. I wanna push you around. Oh, yeah. I wanna push you down. Well, I will. Well, I will. This is the final stage of our plan. Give them their dreams. <laughs> 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 Who are you texting? No one. Let me just. <laughs> Ten! <laughs> it's a beautiful song that you're playing. Did you write it? Yes. You want to sit here and watch me do it while I stare uncomfortably into your eyes before it happens? I would love that. I would love that. I want to push you around. <laughs> When we're on the battlefield and you say Ken at 4 o'clock, how will I know if you mean us Kens or the other Kens? Because, my dudes, we attack at 10 o'clock. Take advantage of the morning. <laughs> the morning <laughs> waves, no! All the TVs are synchronized. To a horse. Yeah. It doesn't seem to matter what I do. I'm always number two. No one knows how hard I tried. Oh, oh, I... She's just waiting a flag. <laughs> Horse boats. Okay. Horse pedal boats, even. Oh, it's like a chariot. chariot. On the waves. <laughs> hey! 
<laughs> Men in war. So dumb. <laughs> <laughs> you on the Malibu Beach! Oh, oh my gosh! Yes! Oh, titty twisters! Oh. <laughs> no, take <it's laughs> that horse! Uh, Ken never looked like that. He's making his own choices <laughs> now. <laughs> it might be a beach off. Today, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, ladies, let's do this. All those in favor of letting Barbie Land be Barbie Land, say aye. Aye! Yeah! The galloping. It's like Monty Python, you know? It is. It is. They're so cringe. <laughs> He's just like, huh? Joe Dojo Casa House is just getting dreamier. That's because they're dream houses, mother. <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> to be honest, when I found out the patriarchy wasn't about horses, I lost interest anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so funny. I always thought this would be our house. Oh. Ken. <laughs> I think I owe you an apology. Huh? I'm really sorry I took you for granted. Oh. Not every night had to be girls' night. Thank you for saying that. Thank you. Oh, I didn't mean to suggest, uh... I just don't know who I am without you. You're Ken. You're Ken, buddy. You have a song. But it's Barbie and Ken. There is no just Ken. Maybe it's time to discover who Ken is. Okay. I think I get it now. No, 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 no. This isn't the answer. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying. He's trying. I look so stupid. <laughs> I look so stupid! Oh, no! You look so cool! <laughs> okay, Ken, you have to figure out who you are without me. Maybe it's Barbie and... It's Ken. Ken is me? Yes. Ken is me. And I'm Barbie. Ken! <laughs> <laughs> I want you to have it. It's... Ah! Oh. 
<laughs> Minge. I thought we discontinued. <sighs> no Barbie or Ken should be living in the shadows. Poor Alan. <laughs> Poor Alan. Poor Alan. May I please have sanitation? What? <laughs> <laughs> Can <laughs> please? <laughs> okay. Justice. Oh, I can't do that. But maybe a lower circuit court judge. We accept, as long as we can wear robes. Well, the Kens have to start somewhere, and one day the Kens will have as much power and influence in Barbie Land as women have in the real world. Now I don't want to. Just go. I can't. Go up and go. I have an idea. Tell me your secret dream, child. Okay. What about ordinary Barbie? That's a terrible idea. Yeah, that's going to make money. Oh! Yeah. Uh, oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Good thing he has his little tablet. Yeah. Tablet. yeah. <laughs> They're flying off the shelves. I don't think I have an ending. That was always the point. <laughs> I created you so you wouldn't have an ending. Baby, I am Mattel. Until the IRS got to me, but that's another <laughs> That's another, another movie. movie. Oh, man. Inventor of Barbie. What? Oh, that's so her ghost keeps an office on the 17th floor. What? what? You got her ghost. Thank you. And Kenneth. Thank you, Barbie. You got that quick. <laughs> yeah, you did. Humans make things up like patriarchy and Barbie just to deal with how uncomfortable it is. I understand that. And then you die. <laughs> <laughs> Do you give me permission to? Become human? You don't need my permission. But you're the creator. You don't you control me? I can't control you any more than I could control my own daughter. I used to float. Now I just fall down. I used to know. But I For the pastels of oh, spoiler. Phoenix. Oh, yeah, yeah. Everybody saw that trailer. Thanks. Yeah. Thank you for everybody. <laughs> Froze. <laughs> Orgulloso. Orgulloso. <laughs> yeah, Birkenstocks. But they're pink. Yep. <laughs> it's like a middle ground. <laughs> pink and stocks. I'm not called brown and stocks. Is Burke in a color? Hi. Name? Oh, Burke um, and Bay. Handler, <laughs> comma, Barbara. No. And what are you here for today, Barbara? I'm here to see my gynecologist. <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I remember Midge. I remember she had she was pregnant. She had a belly you could flip over and take yeah. the baby out. Oh man, <laughs> I remember that. Yeah, I never I found owned one. one. I found one at a yard sale, and I, was, yeah. I thought it was the weirdest thing. <laughs> Ice Spice in Nicki Minaj. Oh, okay. Ice Spice. Ice Spice. Okay. okay. I thought there was a third, but I do like these credits showing like all the different like. Yeah, yeah and mm -hmm. I, there's I, the growing up skipper. I remember that skipper too. It, I found it weird. A working video camera? No, the one with their, her boobs grow. No, that one. Yeah, this one has. It's a video camera, camera in the front and a screen in the back. That's more recent, actually, yeah. I think. That's crazy. Those pink credits. Mm hmm. I like that. Looks color. good against black. Black pink. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's coming double layered. <laughs> yeah. 
I didn't know if I was gonna have to change. Wait. Oh, there's, there's Bradley Cooper in there somewhere. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he's the carpenter. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it's like that. It's like, hey, it you wanna be, be in this movie? So like, yeah, sure, what do you want me to do? Build steps. <laughs> Hold it's a hammer. Definitely not the same. But it would be funny to be in the same industry as a very much more famous yeah, person. Yeah, like you think you're getting Bradley Cooper, but it's not the Bradley Cooper. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, like, you know, you're calling for a reservation in LA, you know? Yeah, right? Yeah, well, hey, can I get Cooper a party of five? table? What's his name? It's Bradley, Bradley Cooper. Right? And then he comes in, everyone thinks he's lying. Oh, it's the carpet. Here's my driver's license! Right? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, who's my patient next? Bradley Cooper. And then just the disappointment everywhere you go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, right. that, would be, that would be terrible, actually. I feel bad for that guy. It's like Michael Bolton in Office Space. Yeah. Michael Bolton. Is that why Rick goes by Rick and not Rick, like Ricky? You used to go by Ricky. And Ricky Martin. People made it, made like they. Yeah. It was in the '90s, so he was popular. Yeah. You were like, yeah. oh, Ricky Martin, oh, Ricky Martin. You just get tired of it, I bet, right? Rick. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you got sick of it. I grew up calling him Ricky. What the fuck, Richard? <laughs> I'm gonna need some Obi cuddles after that movie. Yeah, that was. I felt like I, I fell into an alternate reality where this movie exists and is awesome, and it shouldn't be because it's a movie about Barbie. And it's so good. Weren't like, you expecting it to be good though? Uh, well, like, I, I was, but I wasn't expecting it to be that one point. I thought this movie was supposed I thought it was to be, be like happy. Well, yeah, I mean, like I like it, but I just notice it's all a different the feeling than just negative things in the world. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> like why do why do people watch this? Well, I guess it's like a palate cleanser, I guess, for Oppenheimer. I mean, man, there's problems well, with that, right? Yeah. Problems yeah. in the world. <laughs> no, I mean, it's for me it's like it's 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 feel it's good feelings and it's bad feelings. It's a mixture. It's a, it's an acceptance in a in a I don't know, just a really cool way well, yeah. of looking at Every, everything. Uh, really, you know, everything uh, should uh, be in balance. A, a cultural right? milestone of a toy and what the toy means, not what the toy. Uh, well, they, does, she invented you know. Barbie with the intentions of it. You know, mm-hmm. being you can be whatever you want. Girls are sure, equal yeah. to boys. You know all that. But the problem that stayed in Barbie Land and didn't make it out to the real world is that girls grow up mm-hmm. and they start to experience the real world yeah. and they find out the hard way. All of these other problems that yeah. life brings. And sure. Yeah. Yeah. And the movie shows like in Barbie Land and in the real world, there's this despairing yeah. gap between like here over here. It's like oh, this is a perfect world mm-hmm. with the Barbies. Like mm-hmm. yeah, but then you also have the Kins who are like, where they are don't the, have an identity. Where are the Kins houses? Yeah, yeah. Huh, I don't know. <laughs> you know, like they're yeah. Yeah. they're they're just also there. Like they even start at the beginning where it's like Ken has a good day if Barbie looks mm-hmm. at him. You know, or like, like the, yeah. when they went yeah. to Mattel and he's like, well, you still have Ken. You could have Ken. And he's like, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, like they need Barbie. Yeah, no, we don't but, need that. Yeah, like Ken doesn't exist or have meaning. He's or, so ill-defined yeah. that his job is beach. Yeah. yeah. He's an accessory to take to the beach yeah. Yeah. in your Malibu car. Yeah. And yeah. then you jump over to like the real world and you have yeah. things kind of flipped with yeah. that where like he's looking at all the men control the world mm-hmm. here and you know the Barbie is a response yeah. to this. Sasha is yeah. talking about how like yeah. oh Barbie put us back and, and you I, know you set unrealistic expectations I of agree women with that and part stuff too, like that. You know? Know? Like, that was a big thing. Yeah. There's a lot of aspects of that that she says where it's like yeah I can definitely see that. For, it took a long time, even when I was the age to play with Barbies and stuff, there mm-hmm. were there was no diversity in Barbies mm-hmm. at that time too. Sure. You yeah. know, and there were starting to branch out into like, oh, the Doctor Barbie and all of that stuff, but I never had a Ken, you know? Yeah. Like, he he yeah. was always just kind of superfluous. He was an add on. Mm-hmm. Even Barbie and, said that in the movie, right? Yeah, he was, he was yeah. extraneous. So it's kind of like the two opposite extremes in the yeah. real world and the Barbie. He was an accessory yeah. to the Barbie. Yeah. And like and the you... women are a little bit less like powerful, mm-hmm. less like accomplished. It's harder to get up in the world. Yeah. And I find a lot of hard truth when they showed that Mattel, the top mm-hmm. people in Mattel. With all the and guys it's all around just men. It and... Yeah. Can yeah. I talk to the woman in charge? Yeah. The CEO? It's like CFO? They, COO? Yep. Barbie president? Like, all yeah. these but things, like, but I had the, the right goals when I started in this position, so I mm-hmm. represent you. But no, you, sure. you're, you're, yeah. Will Ferrell, you don't. Yeah. yeah. I like the, 
relationship between Sasha and the mom too. Yeah, that was. It kind of reflects a lot of that too, where it's like, here's what we're playing, and you're being, you know, here's a a woman, and you can be whatever you want to be when you grow up and stuff. Then she grows up, and there's distance, but there's also the connection of family and. Yeah. You know, I used to be able to play with my daughter. Now my daughter doesn't want yeah. me to play with her and stuff. You know? I think her playing with the Barbie and that broke everything too is because when you grow up, you grow out of Barbies like the daughter did. You give them away. They, you know, you stop playing with them and you forget about them. Whereas the mom remembered and she yeah. went back and tried to get back that age of innocence for her and mm-hmm. yeah. you know the good times when she didn't have so much to think about and worry about on her shoulders yeah, and, yeah. Stuff. and the barbie yeah. she's thinking of being the kid's barbie yeah but it's like the mom's barbie. yeah it's mom's really her holding on yeah. and playing with it even when you cut back um when you watch and she's like thinking about her barbie being played with mm-hmm. when you look at sasha and who she's playing with yeah she has two different barbies yeah. she doesn't have the stereotypical yeah. barbie which is what the, the mom was playing. holding yeah. yeah yeah it's such an it's so interesting to me like uh i, I definitely feel like i have a, a a point of view of like an outsider looking in just because like in my own you know i still collect toys but yeah. you know the, my relationship with toys was never emulate a vocation or a behavior to prepare myself for adulthood. It wasn't like care for a baby or play house or be a firefighter. Mm-hmm. It was always Batman and Turtles and Star yeah. Wars and just I want a new one so that I have a, a new avatar to create my own stories and, and let my imagination go crazy. It was never about emulating a, a, a something like that. And sure. it's kind of, well, yeah. But, but then I think about the girls' aisle and they didn't really have a whole lot more options. Oh, there there wasn't a lot of variety, and there wasn't a lot of, like... I also feel like commercials and how it's marketed has a lot to do with how you play with toys. Mm, sure. Yeah. Well, between the toys and stuff, too, that's one of the main differences. Is a lot of the girls' toys often were, like, in the very beginning, here's baby the doll. baby doll. Yeah. Take yeah. care mm-hmm. of the baby, and then yeah. it's, like, fostering... Pretend to be a mom. Yeah. Motherhood yeah. kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. Or yeah. you end up getting, like, the initial Barbies, and maybe they have, like kitchens and they have like yeah. you know these aspects of like well when you grow Taking up care of the this house is what you do so it was home. like a step towards feminism it was trying yeah. to give girls more you know confidence to grow up and stuff and become other things yep. and they did spearhead that you know by doing the, but they they stopped growing with the times at some point you know it's, with Barbie it's a yeah it's it's progress but it's not perfection yeah right just like Barbie in this movie like she she isn't perfect because yeah. The, the image of perfection has all these other things under it that you yeah. have to ignore to be able to go on. Sure. It's really, man, it's a really layered movie. Mm-hmm. No, I respect definitely. the hell out of it. Man, Kate McKinnon's character, most of my Barbies look like Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I had, my mom used to worry about me because my Barbies, she would come in my room and there would be disembodied legs yeah. and the heads would be off and she was worried about me, like, why are you, like, in yeah. here pulling, and I was like, no, I was trying to play with her the way I would play with you know, another girl, yeah. and I want to brush their hair. If they go swimming, sure. I want to comb their hair off. Their hair gets tangled, and I rip their heads off with the brush, you know? like, And then, like, the legs thing was like, well, I took dance a lot, so I could do the splits, but when it came to the center splits, Barbie's legs do not move that way, and they yeah. would pop out, you yeah. know? So... With me, it wasn't... I, I empathize it, with that Barbie. <laughs> it wasn't unintentional. <laughs> I would pull them apart and then sort them by body part. Oh, so you did the Toy Story thing where you I did the Toy Story. Well, no, I didn't. Together. I didn't put like five heads on one oh. torso or anything like that. I just, yeah, I would just pull them apart. And you wonder why we thought you could be a serial killer, Calvin? I sorted them by body part. <laughs> well, <laughs> trying to move away. <laughs> I mean, yeah, no. the Barbie in my toy box is the weird Barbie, just yeah. because. That's, like, the only Barbie that, like, I can't play with the nice one. Here, take this one, you know? I'm like, okay. And I would go and make my own stories. Such sure. good casting with Kate McKinnon. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Well, and we, Ryan Gosling. Ryan Gosling was a really I read nice somewhere, movie. I don't know if you've seen it, too, like, Margot Robbie wanted Ryan Gosling in this movie, uh-huh. and she had to make a deal with him that she would give him a present every single day of filming for I him to him accept that, it. No. Yeah, and it was, like, huh. little things sometimes, you know, just little things. But he got a gift every day that they were filmed. Her. <laughs> I saw that it was on like a bucket list of hers of like yeah. meet Ryan Gosling and stuff. Uh, <laughs> I, can see, I can see that. Yeah. I loved when Sasha 
called her a fascist. He's like, I don't control the railways <laughs> or the flow of commerce. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> I like I like the uh, the big speech that Sasha's mom gives. Yeah, where man, that's my favorite part. Like, oh, it's like yes. you gotta be pretty, but you can't be too pretty because yeah. then you're tempting. That's what you're, women you know, live You're with. drawing too oh, much yeah. attention to yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Today, yeah. Like you've heard me say that too. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, I gained weight. I don't want to gain. I can't yeah. gain. Yeah. You know, and yeah. stuff. You want to be thin, but you can't say thin. You can't, you can't thin. say you, you want to be healthy, skinny, but you just yeah. want to be thin and. Yeah, like that whole spiel that she has, that like speech or monologue, mm-hmm. whatever you want to call it, is just has a lot of reflection on just like what it feels like in the real world when she's telling. And then yeah. it wakes up these Barbies because you're like, what was it? All the Barbies are either brainwashed or were ugly and weird. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or discontinued. Yeah. yeah. yeah those discontinued yeah. ones. I, I like that they shed light on a lot of these discontinued ones where it's like, mm-hmm. oh, there's Midge. She was pregnant. We got yeah. rid of her. <laughs> you know? Yeah, like, it's kind of like it speaks to society too. Like, sure. Like which ones were not successful. Yeah. You know? Although that TV Sorry. one is a little wa- weird. <laughs> TV one was weird. <laughs> yeah. That's true. No. Yeah. Um, Midge was Alan's like girlfriend and then wife and then they had kids and they made a pregnant Midge. Yeah. They oh, discontinued yeah, okay. that. Huh. So that's where Alan Because they felt like it was promoting girls getting pregnant. Yeah. Huh. Or something. I can I can see that. I guess I never really But also with... it 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 does like create kind of a, a stigmatism. Yeah, it does. Stigma it totally it. does. Because yeah. like, oh no, like being pregnant is wrong because so we're discontinuing this. Yeah. Well it implies sex. Yeah. Right. But sure. they don't have but parts. They, can we stay the night tonight and do what? I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So the, like, bo- the blow up boob Barbie was real? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's wow. a real Barbie. The, okay. the skipper. Skipper grows up or something, yeah. yeah. Okay. Grown up skipper. Yep. Wow. I don't know. I, I never thought of like the intention of Barbie versus the reality effect of Barbie. You well, know, yeah. like the intention was so, there to so you, broaden you, girls' minds, sure. and, you know, but the reality effect was all of a sudden she became this unattainable, you know. Thing she was, that you were supposed to look like. She was put in a box. Yeah. yeah. You have Barbie and it's yeah. like this Marilyn Monroe kind of figured but, thing and then yeah. people are looking, oh, that's how I'm supposed mm-hmm. to look. And, and if then, I don't look like that, yeah. I'm the one that's wrong, yeah. not yeah. Barbie's the one that's wrong. Yeah. yeah. And then you also are holding up gender stereotypes that are something that we create as a mm-hmm. society, not necessarily something that's inherent about being a person or a human, right? Like this, the color pink is like, well, that's for girls. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sure. I like that the they never change the pink. Yeah, me too. Even when the yeah. even when the Kens took over, yeah. they didn't change the pink. Sure, you know, yeah. everything was still pink. Pink's still yeah. there. Yeah, it goes both ways too. It's not just about how women are treated or have to you know survive in today's world, right? Like well, it's also it's, the men too. It's, it's how men aren't taught to like yeah use their masculinity and safe and non-violent yeah. ways sometimes. Yeah, but you know? it's also like, like when they were mansplaining. In a constructive way. Yeah, <laughs> with the decoy Barbies. It's kind of like they don't have to do that. They could sit down some of the yeah. Kens and try to logically, you know, talk to them. Mm-hmm. But they treated them like airheads, you sure, know? Yeah. And they, like, went to them to get them to mansplain to them just to do other stuff. But that's not how men should be treated either, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, it's it goes both yeah. ways. That's yeah. one thing I liked about whenever I'd seen it before was, like, it's not just saying, like... Well, Ken's evil. Yeah, yeah, it's not just doing that. And, like, Ken comes back, and all the Kens come back, yeah. and it's like, ah, oh, the men have taken over, and this is bad, and mm-hmm. you have to fix it. It's shedding more light on, like, well, there's not there's not an equality between yeah. all this, right? Yeah. There was finding, an imbalance to like, begin with, the, and trying now to meet in the middle. It's the other either side. one or the other, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. I mean, like, you don't see until, like, he gives it up, and the Barbies take back, like, how Ken really did feel like he had no identity. Yeah. He... That, was just trying to great. learn about it's who he was. Yeah. Party. Yeah. Well, the uh, the song that they sing, the um, I'm Just Ken song, yeah. um, apparently was written as a joke by the composer, and then Greta liked it so much, and then whenever Ryan Gosling got it, he pushed for it to be a musical number in, yeah. the, in the movie because cool. he nice. connected and understood it and thought that it had more meaning, and the composer was like, the 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 meaning he took from this and the way he looked at it yeah. made it better. Yeah. Like, a lot of the lines in it are talking... Like, he says, like, I'm I'm a Ken and anywhere else I'd be a 10. So he's like, yeah. you know, I, I look good. But all these Kens look good, so I don't mm-hmm. stand out at all. And he's like, am I enough? Will she look at me? Like, like she, his has, value is completely 100% off yeah, of Barbie. Dependent. It's all about finding yeah. Barbie and yeah. getting her to acknowledge to him and his him. existence yeah. and his, like, all that. But when and, brought into the real world, Barbie has so many different challenges than he has, like... 
She sure. can walk around and be like, wow, this is amazing. And she walks around and is like, I'm afraid. Yeah. It's Just because by she, being a, for the first time, yeah. there was no fear. There was no pain. There was yeah. no aging or sickness mm-hmm. in Barbie land, you know? So. Yeah. yeah. You know, it's a very, this is going to sound weird, it's a very Adam and Eve story, right? Adam, the first man created by God, gets lonely. So God creates for man a companion. It's so he opposite. won't be lonely. It's kind of like Ken but, was created yeah, for but Barbie. Barbie yeah. yeah, Ken's created for Barbie. And then you have Ruth taking the God walking through the garden role and trying to explain it more. It's, it's a very uh, mythological story in there. I really it, mm-hmm. it, it, it should not be this good. Yeah. <laughs> I, I've never seen Battleship, and I made the joke, but I, I'm sure it's not this good. Yeah. <laughs> it's not. I also like no. the line where she said, like, mothers stand still so their daughters can look back uh, and see how far they've come. Yeah, that yeah. was amazing. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. I'm seeing my gynecologist. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great ending. That was perfect. That was a yeah. great ending because it's so real too. Yeah. <laughs> Did you know that her hair had to be tinted for every outfit she wore, really? just so it would keep that pinky blondness uh, in for, her, uh, for whatever color she was wearing? Margot. Yeah. I think she also wore like eighteen wigs to yeah. the movie or yeah. something like that too. Yeah, that makes sense. She had, they had to like. Yeah. Tint it. You want that color temperature not to click. Yeah, yeah I get you. Mm. To turn brassy. Or, Man, they yeah. probably had to think a lot about color temperature with the studio lights and how it interacts with the Well, yeah, I mean, like so stuff. many wow. bright colors and like those rollerblades, yeah. right? Like, yeah. how do you Gosh. adjust yeah. for all of that mm. and so they, much neon? They also did as much as they could practically. Yeah. Mm. Um, yeah. I think even the transitions from Barbie Land to the real world is like a practical Were like there, filming like, thing. Like it's not like CGI'd oh, on those cool. things. So like when things are moving in the background or like the birds there, like mm-hmm. it's a real bird that they have. It's not like a CGI fake bird. Mm. Stuff. Interesting. So they did as much of that as they yeah. could. Oh practice. yeah. It was like on a string. Yeah. 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 Cool. I gotcha. Yeah. Like it looked silly and fake and it wasn't a, it wasn't a real bird, but it was physically there. It was a physical yeah. real bird. It wasn't flat. But it doesn't have life. Yeah. I thought Will Ferrell's specific brand of humor matched the tone of the movie very well. I think it did, yeah. especially just like the over-the-top, like yeah. ditzy CEO that yeah, generally, only makes decisions based on money. Yeah, generally you bring him in, and, the, and he changes the tone. The performative yeah. inclusivity, and I'm the yeah, son of a yeah. mother. I'm a mother of a son. <laughs> I have Jewish friends. What was yeah. that like? I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> I don't know if you took it the same way, but like, you know, after when she has the conversation with Ken, he's crying mm-hmm. and he's like, he came back from the real world and he's like, crying's not weak. Mm-hmm. I'm a liberated man or something like yeah. that. I kind of like that juxtaposition where like Barbie Land froze in time. Mm-hmm. So he was always under that mask. Like, what is it to yeah. be a man from like the 1950s? Or sure, you, know, like, you yeah. can't cry, you can't show emotion and stuff. Mm-hmm. But sure. then there was some progress made because when he did go to the real world, it, he discovered it is okay for men to cry. It is okay for men to. Yeah. You know, sure. like have emotions and feel other stuff. Well, and Barbie's yeah. being played with by people yeah. too. Like, yeah. like Ken's always going to be played. Not he always, wants to be with Barbie. He's primarily <laughs> being played by girls. So, like yeah. men in the mm-hmm. real world or boys in the real world mm-hmm. aren't putting their thoughts and futures and dreams yeah. on him, yeah. which is why he doesn't have mm-hmm. that stable base. Hmm. Ah, so you're thinking that because he went to the real world, he was liberated that to be able to he cry? Had that, cause he had that, because he was always so trying to be the macho guy, try to be the mm-hmm. most, you know, like... Hmm. Yeah. See, I was thinking of it more of, like, because, like, he was liberated from the rule and all that kind of stuff. Uh, like, like from in being there. in the patriarchy. Yeah. Yeah. Like after the, I guess it could be both, yeah. Like, after, be, after the song and stuff, yeah. and they're like, put your manly hand in mine. And yeah. Like, yeah. I mean, it, it's, a bit, it's, it's both, right? Like... In moderation, all of those mm-hmm. things are good. Sure. It's just when you go too far with it. Mm-hmm. And obviously, he goes too far with it because he's never experienced yeah. it before. So he's chasing the dragon, <laughs> in a way. And trying to bring it back to the others. Uh, and I like the, the ending, world. too, where they're like, the Kens can work their way up. Like, it yeah. will. Yeah. their aim is to be equal. You they're know? like, can we build a Supreme Court? <laughs> like, no. <Not> yet. <laughs> but how about a smaller court judge? Yeah. <laughs> and then I think it's the narrator. It's like, yeah. can work the way yeah. up. <laughs> Dude, that part when they're like, directors know. Obviously, this message doesn't work as well <laughs> when you're casting Margot Robbie. Margot Robbie, Robbie was to the not the right makers. person to cast. Yeah. I, I mean, it is a break of the fourth wall, but yeah. it was I It was, it was so a good, good yeah. bit of like... Relief right before, man, that, that yeah. speech that just guts you. Yeah. <laughs> sure. Yeah. 
I, I mean, the, the movie's already a commentary, so it didn't mm-hmm. feel like it like intruded in on the storytelling. Before. Sure, yeah. and they have narration throughout different yeah. parts mm-hmm. and stuff yeah. too. And yeah, I know Melanie, and I think her friend that when we watched it was. It's like she's like I'm not beautiful. And it's like what's she talking about? <laughs> yeah, right. And then they say that like okay, good. They shed light on it too. It's not just <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's not exactly like those... she's all that because yeah, she's right. never yeah. ugly to begin all with. All those in that movies movie. yeah. where they cast like an actually beautiful girl and then like do her hair bad. Oh, and oh I'm sorry, they glasses. Put, like, put her hair up right like yeah. back here. Yeah, or and they give her glasses. They give her glasses. And then they give her baggy clothes. Braces. Yeah. 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 And then they take all that stuff off, and yeah. oh, look at this! You cast a beautiful girl to play a yeah. beautiful girl. But I guess surprise, the surprise. message is slightly different with the Barbie thing: is that she is perfect, she is gorgeous, and it, it's still not enough. No, you my, know, like what? My favorite part of it is like discovering crying, and even though it's causing her pain and grief, it's kind of amazing because she can finally vent feelings yeah. she didn't know that she had. And sure. of course, Ken gets to do that too. <laughs> I like when. Don't uh, look at me! Yeah. <laughs> I like a few of the surreal moments when, like, she's looking at, like, the uh, park and she mm-hmm. sees, like, these kids playing, mm-hmm. this guy's sad, these people arguing, these people hugging. Like, yeah. the emotions then, that are in the world. Yeah, yeah, and then she looks over at, like, the old lady next to her and she's like, You're beautiful. You're beautiful. And she's like, I know. <laughs> yeah, I love the confidence. I, I just, I like that whole segment there, yeah. but it, it works too with, like, what you're saying about, like, she's beautiful and all this and like she she still isn't happy or whatever mm-hmm. too but like but the old there's, lady yeah, yeah there's the old lady's content and she's yeah. passed yeah. a lot of those issues that as we grow older we, we kind of like drop and let go mm-hmm. and they're not they don't they don't sting as much mm-hmm. and it's like yeah i am she's gotten that self-confidence and some for some of us it takes a lot longer than others to get yeah. there yeah um the lady that played that was like an uh, oscar winning like uh like costume. Oh wow! Uh, Sweet. Maybe like she that. made the costume. Like a costume designer. Yeah. yeah. Like uh, Greta apparently fought for her to stay there. The executives wanted to like cut that like older lady scene yeah, out of the there. Yeah, the bus stop. Oh, yeah. that was like the best part of that really sequence. Touching I, liked, I liked her like oh, like yeah. getting that tear, you know, and, and then like looks over. And, mm-hmm. hmm. No. Man, the girl who plays Sasha has been in some crazy franchises. She's been <laughs> in this movie, which is the biggest movie of this year. She was in Marvel and in Star Wars. That's crazy. Yeah. I don't know her name. I'm sorry. I apologize. <laughs> I don't know why. I feel relief. Yeah? After watching the movie. Yeah. Like, like they get it. Yeah. <laughs> Do you guys see, like, where controversy or whatever came from? No. Yeah. Like, I know, like, there's different people who are, like... I see where it came from. Yeah. Like, people burning Barbies Right at the beginning, you know, where like, I think Barbie was going to solve all feminism and create oh, equality man. and all uh, that. I'm like, uh-huh. Oh, I boy. mean, if, 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 if forced to go there, sure. But I think I, the thing I love the most is you, you don't feel studio interference here. It feels like a, an artist yeah. communicating a point and it got to but me. I can I'm, see where... I'm, I'm really... It feels more like that. they fought to get what they yeah. wanted yeah. and I'm glad that they And did. to stay true to what they wanted mm-hmm. the story to be. But I can see like how some people out there might have be offended or like not like oh. the way they portray Ken or other stuff, you know, but... Sure. I think, I think those it's people have, have problems with themselves yeah. more than they do like, with the movie. Learn something. And the movie just <laughs> highlighted <laughs> it. <laughs> Or maybe they're just the the people who were never allowed to cry, like Ken no, that, at the yeah, end, and, that's you know, what I and mean. stuff. And so they just like can't one way or another, yeah. there there is a conflict mm-hmm. there that they haven't. But yeah, dealt I can with. see why it's controversy. Yeah. And there's people I mean, out I, there who would watch the first beginning part, get to the feminism, and be like, nope. Yeah, right. <laughs> you know, sure. and just duck out. There's a part in the middle that if you just stop watching there, it, it, you're like. It's, what's this movie doing? Yeah. I can't believe what they're doing. And they just yeah. walk out. Like, that's yeah. not a good time to end it. Like, yeah. like 17 minutes in? <laughs> well, I think, like, when you Before get to the... Before the speech. Yeah, right? I yeah. think if you get to the point where, like, they've gone to the real world and there's, like, and you're seeing what's happening Ken's with Barbie. You see back. what Ken's yeah. looking at. Him looking at, like, hey, can I be a doctor? Can yeah. I get a sharp thing? Yeah. Plucky pin? <laughs> you know? Like, like, I'm a man. You have to listen to me. Yeah. There's just There you gets know? to a point where you're just kind of like... Wait, what story are they trying to tell you? Yeah. Like, you don't get back to the resolution mm-hmm. in Barbie Land and everything, mm-hmm. and there's not the talk yeah. about, like, well, things haven't been balanced. Yeah. Ken, you aren't... It's not you're important because of Barbie. Yeah. You're, you can just be Ken, and I can just be Barbie. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I like the inclusion of Alan, too. That not all men are Ken. Not all men are going to be the same, you mm-hmm. know? like. Yeah. I like him kicking a bunch of Ken's butts. Yeah, that was 
That was cool. Once they start learning to build that sideways, we'll be in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and, I don't want to say it. No. Yeah. <laughs> I guess, well, I, I guess forgive the gendered expression, but a lot of these jokes just had some balls to them. Like the, the smallpox joke about how they had no defenses against this, and that's why it was able to spread through so quickly. Like... Yeah. Studio movie, like that's yeah. a, that's a hell of a joke that yeah. generally people like Warner are gonna come in like, hey, can we like not do that yeah. and maybe find they something else? They just didn't else? care. And they that's wanted, why I feel yeah. like, man, that's a that's an that's an artist just saying what they want. Not, I think it's also a good yeah. way of explaining what they're it, talking it is, about. Absolutely. It's like they don't know what a patriarchy yeah. is. They yeah. don't understand. Barbie that, Land but, like, has never been They don't been know the trap that they're falling that. into. But like yeah. that's that, yeah. that's a joke in a movie about a kid's toy, you know, from like the company. Like, Mattel's involved with this. Like, yeah. from the company that makes the kid's toy and still needs to continue to market it to children. Mm -hmm. You know? Like, if you make a Transformers movie, but you're actually talking about the human spirit, you know? Like, how, how many Transformers toys yeah. are you going to sell? So I, I respect that at least Warner and Mattel gave uh, Greta, was the name of the director? Yeah. Or did she write, too? I don't know who wrote it, but Margot was yeah. highly involved, yeah. too. Okay. Oh, well, yeah, sure, but... Uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I might be wrong and people tell me stories, but it felt like a, a lack of interference from the studio, which it's not like Warner has the best reputation yeah. right now when it comes to I mean, I think she signed with, one of those Ben artists. Affleck type contracts mm -hmm. where she has so many movies that she can do what she mm -hmm. wants, you know, yeah. or something. Yeah. Awesome. Or make them the way she wants or yeah. something like that. If she stays exclusive with Warner or something. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I feel like I remember that being said years ago, like when I was still at Warner. Yeah. It's white savior Barbie. Yeah, that was funny. <laughs> that was so good. And I love the choice. I mean, it's probably in the script, but like Ken, like hears that from Barbie and goes into his house. Sublime. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering what he was gonna do. Yeah, I like when he comes out. He's like, "Call me Reed." Oh yeah. Oh, After he's like scrambling, and there's no yeah. door, and there's no walls in the Barbie dream house. You can no. see everything. Yeah. No. A lot of the things too of like the misunderstanding mm -hmm. of things is great. Yeah. Like I, I, I really love when he like tries to do the cool like put the sunglasses on. And then puts another. Puts another pair on. <laughs> mm -hmm. His slide yeah. down the truck. Like he's trying to do the cool things, yeah. but he yeah. doesn't yeah. understand the yeah. cool things yeah. either. Yeah. And I like how it was like they were both at fault. Barbie never tried to understand Ken. No. You know, yeah. like it took it until the end where she was yeah. like, I never realized that you have no identity. Yeah. <laughs> And that's all he wanted, is yeah. his own identity, right? They I were do. trying to find the same thing. Yeah, they are. And I love the way they both play the characters. Like, I think yeah, Margot plays Barbie really well. Yeah. I think Ryan played his kin great. Yeah. Like, I, I love when he'd be like, oh. <laughs> like, whenever he was like, take your this and this. And then he's just like, like he's just destroying <laughs> stuff. And I was like, it's just, it's so yeah. funny. He's just so over the top, I like Simu in this, too. Simu was hilarious. Simu was good. Yeah. yeah. Hilarious. I was telling Perfect Calvin, opposite for Ryan. <laughs> yeah. I was telling Calvin, there's a thing I read that talked about Simu. Uh, he did a flip when they were doing, like, dance rehearsal stuff. And apparently Ryan Gosling's reaction to that made Greta want to make the kin and his kin and his kin, like, more rivals. yeah. Rather than, like, just being, like, yeah. just kins and Buddies. friends and stuff. Gotcha. I was like, well, that's funny. Like, I, what was his reaction to that? Was he like, yeah, you know, <laughs> I just wonder. I mean, all that training that he did with the Shang Chi, like yeah. the intention, even in that theatrical play fighting they were doing, like all the yeah. intention was still there, and the lines in the body, in relative to the camera, like it's all, it's a muscle that he's just flexed a lot recently, mm -hmm. you know. Like it's like the dance fight. Yeah, me too. Okay. I love the dance fight. It's weird to say this, but this is like an award-winning movie for me. It's up there. No, it's definitely good. Yeah, really good. Yeah. And it's Barbie. <laughs> and it's commercially... Something I've never played with in decades. No, it, it has deeper meaning than just yeah. being like, here's a here's a show about a toy. Yeah. You know, it's mm -hmm. not... like It's like a, it's like when you watch Toy Story and you're like, oh, it's kids' toys oh, coming wait, to life. What's it going to be about? And there's like, wreckage. this is some really cool stuff with yeah. this, you know? Yeah. You get a couple movies in and you're crying. Like, oh, yeah. no. So, no, it's, it's done really well. Covers some important themes and stuff, too, and just sheds light on different mm -hmm. things. Yeah. While also, I think, honoring what the idea for Barbie is supposed to be yeah. and what they're trying to do for Barbie, too. Yeah. yeah. Oh my this yeah, having be a the, point Having the Barbie. creator's character in there, it, it helped highlight yeah. like the intent behind it, but then also admit the flaws mm -hmm. that like it, it created. It got out of her hands. It got away from her. Because like, she created oh, yeah. it for her daughter. You know, She's yeah. not going to aim for this sexualized version mm -hmm. of a woman you know, for her daughter and stuff. It was 
the corporation took over, right? Like, yeah. flat feet! <laughs> 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 yeah, bad you're breath. right. Yeah. I woke up with bad breath, flat feet. Yeah. <laughs> I love all the fake stuff, too, in the Barbie world they do. Or like, like the, she's the like, milk and the drink. Yeah. And yeah. Like, do you want some sparkling water? And they just pour yeah. water in her face. Like, oh. Yeah. I'm not used to that having anything in it. <laughs> the milk being expired, just yeah. with a stamp of expire on it and stuff. And when they throw the clothes, it, like, freezes like a Barbie clothes yeah. advertising like, well, yeah. like a commercial <laughs> yeah that would be ads or it'd be like in the uh in like a newspaper or on mm. the boxes and stuff too and it'd have like yeah. a little circle with like this thing yeah. and like new whatever malibu barbie yeah. you know bathing suit or whatever it is yeah, yeah. just funny a lot of them were reminiscent mm. for me like because i i had a lot of those especially the end credits and stuff mm. some of those yeah, i remember barbie those distinctly and i know i had a skipper Babysitting skipper or growing up skipper or Babysitting, regular skipper? Babysitting, I think. Or? And then there was a younger girl, too, who was supposed to be her youngest, youngest? sister. Yeah. yeah. I don't remember her. My sister used to collect Barbies and stuff. Mm-hmm. She used to always be mad because, like, she wasn't allowed to open them. Like, she was collecting them. That's what my mom was like. Like, toward, she, she would want me to collect them. Like, she would never get me the holiday Barbie because she knew I would take it out of the box and rip its head off and its legs would probably pop off at some point. <laughs> And then I had the, that was another thing too, when you talk about toys and stuff, like boys, in the boys toy aisle would mm-hmm. be like Nintendo. Like that's yeah. where that started being, instead of it being its yeah. own thing. Mm-hmm. So it was like, this is a boys toy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So like I had video games, and my sister had Barbies that she couldn't open. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we want to see the He-Man movie next, right? He-Man? <laughs> I wonder what that would be like. Which one? Very yeah. different. Great movie. Uh, the feeling that I got from it is not what I expected. Mm-hmm. And then... The ending is great. The ending? Mm-hmm. When, when, is like, I want you to understand what you're looking at. Uh-huh. Um, apparently, it's all cast and crew, like, real footage of, like, people that worked on the movie. Oh, that's oh, good. So, nice. like, whenever yeah. she's seeing, yeah. like, the bowling and the kids mm-hmm. playing and all that kind of stuff, too. That's like, really that's, cool. Yeah. That's old footage from, like, family members yeah. and stuff mm-hmm. of the cast and crew. So, it's it's done really well and has, like, that slice of life, like, what is this mm-hmm. meant to be? Those were the moments that I was, like, just tearing up yeah. on, mm-hmm. I'm, on, on its own. Yeah. Just not, they don't even have to say anything. Now, next time we watch Oppenheimer. I won't be here for that problem. Uh, <laughs> hey, everybody. Thank you so much for watching this Barbie reaction. Over at BlindWave.com, you can check out up to the next four movies we have available. But next week, Oppenheimer. Barbenheimer. I, I suppose so. Yes, that is the, uh, the Fortnite at BlindWave that we're calling there. So subscribe. We'll see you back here next week.